Hi everybody, it's Dr. Francine from the Chiropractic Center where we really care about you and your success. And today we are gonna do uh, some foam rolling. We're gonna specialize on the spine. So uh, when we're looking at the spine, remember, we wanna start off at the bottom. Generally that's the best way to go and then go all the way up. Uh, remember to check with your healthcare provider to make sure these exercises are right for you, very important. Um, I have a foam roller and in a previous video I discussed how to choose your foam roller. I like to use this one here. Um, you can start with your glute muscles. I find oftentimes with the low back, that's a great way to start. And you just literally rock back and forth. Um, you can roll a little bit to one side and then you can roll a little bit to the other side. Remember, everybody's gonna have an area that's gonna be a little tighter, a little tense. When you find that area, you can just do little small rolls into that area until that you feel that loosening. And doing this on a regular basis can be a great way to balance your muscles and help with your adjustments. From there, I tend to kind of just roll down like this and lean back very slowly. And sometimes this takes some practice. And then what you can do is just very gently roll back and forth so that you get uh, your back arching down. Sometimes too, if you want to, you can even just hang out here for a little bit. I wouldn't recommend you do it for too long. Some people, you have to work up to it, but you'll see that my bottom's kind of dropping down off the edge of the roller, and then you come all the way up like this, and you just roll back and forth. Now, to do the upper back, you can keep rolling, and if you look, you can see, oh, I hope I just don't have the camera. <laughs> but you can just roll back and forth like this um, to do your mid-back. And then, if you want to, you can even do your upper back. Oh, hello, hope I'm still on the camera. <laughs> uh, and then you come back. I wasn't anticipating rolling right off the right off the screen. So, uh, this is my gratitude ball, and uh, he has definitely starred in a few of my videos. So maybe we should leave a comment as to what you think his name should be. I suggested Wilson last time, but that seems a little a little uh, lame. But uh, anyhow, I like to use my lacrosse ball uh, for my upper back. So if you lay flat on your back again, and just kind of lean to the side, and you can place the lacrosse ball right under your shoulder blade. So I'm going between my spine and my shoulder blade, and I'm rolling, and I'm just gonna roll up and down like this along the upper part of my back. So if I'm leaning, let's see, between, there's my shoulder blade there, I'm rolling there, up and down along this area through here, okay? So the one that I did forget uh, would be, to include, would be your quads so in front of your legs, yeah, that's important. So uh, literally turn onto your uh, tummy and then put the roller underneath and you can roll and again, customize this workout for you. You can uh, kind of go off to the side a little bit, use one leg more than the other and then you can do both at the same time to start off with if you need to, okay? The other one that um, I should include as well would be your uh, tensor fascia lata, which is the muscle that's right at the top here of your pelvis and it attaches into your IT band. So if your IT band is really tight, um, I'm gonna suggest you lay on your side. Now for this one, it's really important. Do not go over your hip joint and you just wanna stay above your hip and go up to the crest of your pelvis. So it's a little tiny area and I kind of like to roll a little bit to the back and then a little bit to the front. Uh, you can also use uh, your lacrosse ball. But you can see here again, I'm using the ball and I'm just going along that area between my hip bone and the top of my pelvic bone here. So you can roll again and I find that that's a really great way to loosen up your pelvis um, and your hips. So I hope you found this video incredibly helpful. I hope that you're able to build on the lower body uh, video that we did and become an expert in rolling. Um, and remember every little thing you do every single day that will lead to better health. And until next time, let your healing begin. And remember, comment about Wilson. Thank you.